Pete, <clears throat> I mean, Jim. No worries. Jim, do you think it's strange when a man carries a purse? Only sometimes. Only if he's yeah. stoned. Well, it's Hollywood, so it's not really that strange. Do you think it's strange when a man carries a rock in a purse? That I would say. Is now, weird. that is a little weird. But the reason I carry this rock in the purse is because it's a very valuable rock. I found this rock in a dream. It was laying on the beach. I picked it up and it vanished right at my fingertips. Rubbed it, came right back. It's kind of a magic rock kind of a thing. But that's not the strange part of my dream. You know the strange part of my dream? What's the strange part of your dream? When I rubbed the rock, something magical really happened. It changed into a beautiful silver coin. I thought perhaps I can change it to gold, but alas, the greed got the better of me. So I changed it back to silver. Would you hold out your hand, please? I'm going to squeeze it very, very tightly, and somehow it goes back into the rock. Now, what happens to the coin, I don't really know, but that's not the strange part of my dream. What's the strange part? Have you ever had one of those, he asked, what's the strange part? I like that. Have you ever wondered, have you had, ever had a dream where you try to do something over and over and over again and you just can't do it? Sure. Well, in this dream, I tried to put the rock back in the purse. I couldn't do it. Could you give it a try? Because in my dream, you see, the purse was made of stone, which makes me one say it. <laughs> was I between a rock and a hard place, or was I just stoned? <laughs> <laughs> what was the other line you?